Welcome back to Smell Good Fragrances. It's me, Sean, TDS, Truck Driver Sean, whatever you want to call me. Today, uh, we're going to do something a little different. Instead of going over a fragrance that comes in these beautiful boxes that we all know so well, uh, I'm going to be talking about, I call them dupesters, or uh, fragrance oil companies. There's some good ones out there today. Good stuff. And bad stuff comes along with these companies. So we'll get right into it. Um, I'm going to mix it up instead of doing from like best to worst. I'm just going to talk about each one and my experience with those. And draw your own conclusions. So we'll start right off because I've done a review of a couple of these already. First company would be Alexandria Fragrances. Okay. This is your bottle you get from them it's got that there talks about your strength what's in it got some Arabic California because what says Arabic more than California right so and get off the handy dandy post-it note because I'm tired of smelling this shit on my skin and when I'm doing multiple stuff it gets a little tricky so to show you the atomizer, fantastic, right? And this right here is their one that's called the Irish Gentleman. It is their take on Green Irish Tweed. And I will say, this nails it. Alexandria Fragrances. They are very good at what they do. Their fragrances are fantastic. Their company, though, as far as they handle their business, is absolute shit. We'll get into that here real quick. This right here, good juice. The juice, I will not say a bad thing about. This juice, as far as companies go, they really nail it. It lasts a long time on your skin. If you get some on your clothes, it's there for days. It, like At the end of the week, when you go do laundry, you're going to smell this. Their stuff kicks ass. I've had problems with the company... Getting stuff like the atomizer broke on one. One of them didn't even have any flavoring in the juice. It didn't smell like anything. It smelled like a like fragrance oil. It just like plain. It, it had nothing to it. And uh, yeah, I've had half my bottles come through shitty. Half my bottles come through good. Juice, amazing though. So if you don't mind your bottle coming through, like if you have your own decant bottles or you have whatever, solid buy. It's like $60 for, I believe it's 50 mil, 60 mil, 50 bucks. Uh, you'll save a lot of money to buy in Green Irish Tweed. And I'm even going to go as far as to say this lasts longer than Creed. Good job, Alexandra. Their fragrances, great. The way they handle their business and dealing with their customers, absolute bullshit. They basically told me to present more proof than what I could or go fuck myself. So, fuck Alexandria Fragrances. They're shit people. First and foremost, absolute shit people. Alright, next one. Dua Fragrances. They actually have a presentation. It's very nice. I just reviewed this particular bottle. It's the only one I have by Dua. I will have more. Um, yeah. I will. But right now, I had to go buy a whole bunch of stuff so I could do this video. Because no one's sending me shit. I have to buy it, right? So, as you can tell, like, you, know, you open this, it's got all kinds of reading for you. The bottle itself sits in here like so. Bottle's got a pretty label on it, as we know from my previous video. If you've watched it, if you hadn't, then all right, you hadn't. Sprayer on that is fantastic. Again, the scent, fantastic. Fifty-five dollar. Ah, oh, that is Black Phantom, but a little bit better. That's what this, this is called, Black Widow. It's an interpretation of Black Phantom, which I prefer this over actual Black Phantom. Longevity, 
is pretty, pretty good. Skin, you're going to get seven to eight hours. You get some on your clothes, it's going to be about 12 hours. You're going to get some time out of it. It's a heavy con concentration. It is the uh, x -ray. And as you can see, there's a color to it. If you're wearing white, do not spray this on your clothes. And don't spray clothes. You want to spray away. Because it is what it is. Right? All right. So, the next one will be the best presentation I have gotten so far. Babylon Fragrances. All right? It's pretty. It's got a ball. Like a lingerie box, but it's bitch bait, right? Open it up, get your bottle. All oh, sexy time. The best presentation. These guys, hands down. Now I've already opened it. I have sent an email to Babylon Fragrance. All right. I uh. Got two bottles. I chose this one for a very specific reason. <laughs> I'm, as you tell, I'm not going to get a tester strip out. Yeah. That's what I got. But, looks awesome. So I unscrew it. Take a little bit of the juice. Put some on my skin to smell it. So good. Juice wise, worth the money. Presentation, worth the money. This is Tobacco Rojo, which is their version of Tobacco Vani by Tom Ford. Tom Ford, it is what it is. You get a Tom Ford fragrance, it's not for everybody. Tobacco Vani is very likable. This is another one of those times where the dupe is better than the real thing. It just is. The smell is gorgeous. It's perfect. Like, the tobacco they use in it, to me, is... It, it's a step above. It, it's so good. Just can't spray the shit. Now, I've not heard nothing back from these guys. I don't know if they just don't check their emails or they don't give a shit. I don't know yet. I can't speak on that. When I do, when I do a review of these... Because I have not done a review of them yet on my channel. I will address that. But I want to at least give them time to get back to me. I personally don't think if you're running a good business. It should take more than a shift to get a hold of somebody. And I have not heard back from them. Good juice. Customer service type stuff. Mm. Yeah, they're slacking. They are. Presentation. Fantastic. The best presentation of any of the dupesters. Sorry, Dua. Yours is really good. But that, that, that is amazing. And the juice, again, spot on. No complaints with the juice. The fucking atomizer, though. Fuck you, you can't spray the stuff, right? Okay, so, so far, no complaints with the juice. All these companies kill it. And... The one I'm saving for last was the very first one that I ever heard of. The first one I ever dealt with. And I, it, they set the bar so high that to this day, the bar is still where it is. All as good as these other ones have been, they do not touch this other brand. One, value for your money. They are the cheapest. And they freaking slay it. Okay, company is called Fragrant Body Oils with a Z, because, you know, that's how they roll. Worst presentation in the game. <laughs> Literally, the worst presentation in the game, but the best juice. All right, this one right here is their take on Elysium. And they take their take so seriously that... They literally put Elysium <laughs> by Rochadeau on the goddamn bottle. 
<laughs> you don't have to wonder what it's a dupe of. You know. And it is 100% a match for Elysium. The Atomizer. Best in the game, son. Did you see that, Atomizer? And it's awesome. You get 12 hours on your skin. You get, I don't know, they can probably pull up someone in a cacophagus, you know, sarcophagus or whatever the fuck it's called. 100 years later and you'll smell this stuff. It's so good. These guys never disappoint me. One of the coolest things my buddy Jay ever told me about was this company right here. Now, I've had problems with them in the past, I will be honest. Um, I have not had problems since I had my one problem. My one problem was I had, uh, I get the roller balls a lot. I'll show you one of those, actually. The spray is great, and I got the spray out because all the other ones are spray, but I personally like the rollers. So let's, uh, let's grab a roller here. This is a roller. All right. This one is Spice and Wood. It's a Creed interpretation, and they nail it 100%. This right here will cost you $12, $12, and it will last you a long time. You get just a little bit of that oil on you, rub it in, a little more oil, rub it in, clean your hands off on your shirt. You, you'll smell this stuff in, until you physically scrub it off. It is so good. It's potent. It lasts forever. It's never stained any of my clothes yet, and... Like I said, uh, price point wise, I think it was like 17 bucks. And it's the same volume as this that cost 60 bucks. Same volume as this, it cost 55 bucks. All right. It's very good. And the uh, Babylon was 45, I think. Best juice, cheapest thing. And they're everything I've tried with them. I've tried a shit ton of them. They nail it every time. Such a good company. Fragrant Body Oils, my number one go to. I tried these other ones out. Uh, customer service for Alexandria and how they treat people. So bad. So bad. And they have people sticking up for them that are just as bad as they are. That's the sad part. I don't know how they pulled that one off. Uh, customer service for fragrant body oils. I had some rollers that didn't work. Like, that. Yeah, I couldn't move them. I tried to get them to work. And they basically told me just to bust it off and stick my finger in it and rub it on myself. Come on, man. Get a roll that don't work. Just take care of your customer, all right? I understand it takes it takes out of your profit margin, but test stuff where you send it out and you won't have that fucking problem. It's that simple. Babylon Fragrance, they get back to me as soon as I want them to? No, but it also is Friday. They might not work Fridays for whatever reason. <laughs> Can't imagine not or No, it was Thursday. It was today, Thursday. Yeah, they didn't get back a hold of me. And that's a little disconcerting for me because I got to hold them very early. And I didn't want money back or nothing. I just want them to send me an atomizer. Technically, they should send me an atomizer and a bottle of something else. Oh, something else about fragrant body oils too. They send you a whole bunch of these little one users right here. I'm excited about this. This is... Baccarat Rouge 540X straight. So I'm going to get a day's wear out of that. They send you uh, four to six, sometimes eight of these things, but nothing. Just let you try other scents, which is awesome. So yeah, anyhow, that's my take on all those. I know there's other brands. Um, I'm always interested in trying other stuff out. I think dupesters are important. I understand this is what gets the job done. But let's face it, if you're, I'm very fortunate. I uh, have bottles I shouldn't own. I don't make a shit ton of money. And I have a pretty nice collection. But a lot of these I've bought in as partials 
or have traded or whatever I've done to get them through uh, groups and stuff. So the dupes, you get them, I just want to smell good. I don't care what the brand is. I don't care what, anything. I just want to smell good. And these dupes nail it. Every single company that I was talking about, when it comes to the juice, they're all fantastic. I have not run into a company yet that has been bad. So with that said, I'm going to let you go. Uh, three companies got the price ranges. The cheapest to me actually performs the best. And they ship quicker than a lot of the other ones. They're still pretty slow, though. I don't know what it is with fragrance companies. They're just slow as shit, every one of them. It's not just one of them, it's all of them. So you got fragrant body oils. They're fantastic. Everything in theirs is basically under 20 bucks. And they do everything. Like the scent that you want, you can get it. And they make their own body wash and stuff with that scent. Candle, it, they do everything. Go check it out. Go to their page and look at what you can do. Uh, Alexandria Fragrance. Again, they're a little up on the pay scale. Way low in the taking care of their customer scale. Worst company ever. Fuck those guys. Good juice, though. I'll probably still end up buying a bottle off them from time to time, but I'll be nervous about doing it. Uh, Babylon Fragrances, again, uh, they might just not have, for whatever reason, gotten a hold of me yet. I'm pretty sure, though. I mean, everybody speaks very highly of that company. I'd be genuinely shocked if I don't get another atomizer, at least. I'm not expecting a free bottle of juice, but technically you know yeah. if your customer got if you got a mail of an atomizer anyway you must have throw a bottle in there you know and do a fragrances great company great presentation i haven't had anything bad happen to have to deal with those guys yet so i don't i don't have anything bad to say <laughs> a little pricey I'll say that. Because when you look at the juice you get, then you look at fra uh, the fragrance oil, body oils company. I will say their take on Black Phantom is spot on to Black Phantom. Whereas Dua's isn't, but I kind of like Dua's better than Black Phantom. Is what it is. Anyhow, y'all have a good one. Do not take my opinion as gospel try some of these yourself if i was you in your very budget conscience i can say full-heartedly safe bet the fragrant body oils company i don't know if it has a thing for their jesus they got a phone number now on i think they never used to have it no it doesn't have their uh Oh, it does. That's their website right there. FragrantBodyOils.com Go there. Try some stuff. I like the rollers, but it does come in the spray. It comes in a straight liquid if you're the type that just likes to splash shit on. Yeah. Cool beans. Y'all have yourselves a good one. If you know any other companies that I should be checking out for this type of stuff, Leave it in the comments and hit that subscribe button. For the love of God, hit that subscribe button. Later.